American Declaration on the Rights of Indigenous People. In section 2, Human Rights and Collective Rights. Article 5, Full Effect and Observance of Human Rights. Indigenous peoples and persons have the right to the full enjoyment of all human rights and fundamental freedoms as recognized in the Charter of the United Nations, the Charter of the Organization of American States and International Human Rights Law. Article 6, Collective Rights. Indigenous peoples have collective rights that are indispensable for their existence, well-being, and integral development as peoples. In this regard, the states recognize and respect the right of the indigenous people to their collective action, to their juridic juridical, social, political, and economic, I think it's judicial, and economic system, systems or institutions to their own cultures to profess and practice their spiritual beliefs and to use their own tongues and languages and to their lands, territories, and resources. States shall promote with the full and effective participation of the indigenous peoples, the harmonious coexistence of rights and systems of the different populations, groups, and cultures. Gender equality. Indigenous women have the right to the recognition, protection, and enjoyment of all human rights and fundamental freedoms provided for in international law, free of all forms of discrimination. States recognize that violence against indigenous peoples and persons, particularly women, hinders or nullifies the enjoyment of all human rights and fundamental freedoms. States shall adopt the necessary measures in conjunction with indigenous peoples to prevent and eradicate all forms of violence and discrimination, particularly against indigenous women and children. Article 8. Right to belong to the indigenous peoples. Indigenous persons and communities have the right to belong to one or more indigenous peoples in accordance with the identity, traditions, customs, and systems of belonging to each people. No discrimination of any kind may arise from the exercise of such a right. Article 9. Juridical personality. <coughs> Excuse me. The states shall recognize fully the jurisdictional personality of the indigenous indigenous peoples, respecting indigenous forms of organization, and promoting the full exercise of the rights recognized in this declaration. Article ten. Rejection of assimilation. 1. Indigenous peoples have the right to maintain, express, and freely develop their cultural identity in all respects, free from any external attempt at assimilation. 2. The states shall not carry out, adopt, support, or favor any policy to assimilate the indigenous peoples or to destroy their cultures. 
Article 11, Protection Against Genocide. Indigenous peoples have the right to not be subjected to any form of genocide or attempts to exterminate them. Article 12, Guarantees Against Racism, Radical Discrimination, Xenophobia, and other related forms of intolerance. Indigenous peoples have the right not to be subject to racism, radical discrimination, xenophobia, and other related forms of intolerance. The states shall adopt the preventive and corrective measures necessary for the full and effective protection of this right.